Now let's work on the slideshow. So under sections, click on slideshow. And here you can edit whether you want it a full screen or adapt to the first slide. So obviously if your slides are different heights, the, the screen won't be jumping up and down. Um, so you can uh, so you can adjust it here. Now you can also choose to center buttons once you add buttons. Okay, so these are here, those titles are the buttons. Mm, show overlay. So overlay this kind of um, this kind of semi permanent uh, semi permanent layer over the image. Uh, you will be able to see it better after I add an image. But I'll just show you. Yeah, it it makes this kind of difference. You can obviously edit the color. So if you wanted to add red, semi permanent, you can also do it this way. And also edit how. You know how, how thick it's going to be so if you want to add more color accent you can increase opacity or you can decrease it as well to make it more transparent and here you will be able to add I believe up to four sliders when it comes to this particular theme so you will be able to select image to add a first slider then obviously um, then obviously optimize the layout add title add calls to action buttons and links. You can source free images also from Shopify libraries. So for this particular example, for this exercise, I'll use one of their images. So click on select image and browse free images. So I know that we will go for this kind of fitness, uh, fitness niche. So let's see which one will work for us best. So fitness and sports, click on it. And let's have a look which one we can add. I really like this one. So let's add it. Click select. And then as you can see, you can change the title. Uh, change the the button. I'll just see if I can adjust the layout of this image. So let's have a look. Middle center is current. How about bottom center? Uh, maybe not. Top center. Okay, so top center layout gives us a better view of the um of the the figures in the photo. Okay, and obviously you can also edit alt tag, so make sure to add it, add alt tag, click save. And now we can change the um, the title, ladies fitness gear, and okay, a link, let's go for one of our collections, okay, t-shirts. Okay, so this is this is the link to collections. Obviously, this is the um, the accent that we chose for buttons. Okay, so shop now view more. Let's change this one to shop now. Shop now and shop now here in this slide title. So how about we'll change it to t-shirts or ladies tops. It doesn't exactly link to tops, but I'll just I'll just show you how to optimize the slide. So let's lay this fitness gear. It's the main title. Shop now. So link the button, and obviously the um uh, the the site title. So if someone wanted to change to swap to another slide, they will know what's on the other slide. So okay, so we've got one. Let's minimize it. Let's optimize the other one. So let's go the same way for images. And I want to tell about delivery. So, okay, I like this image. It kind of shows packed, uh, packed parcel or packed gift. So I'll select it. And then I'll optimize it the same way. So obviously the alt tag 
middle center it's okay so I like like the layout as a test tell your story mm, then set title free shipping and then I haven't got a shipping the shipping page so I'll add I'll uh, link to about us page Mm, learn more get free delivery and there, if the, if it will be linked to a shipping page there will be information that free delivery is available on orders over $100 okay so we've got a second slide mm, optimized uh, we can save it or if you add another one I'll show you it will be at content image slide it will be shown as the third slide in a row so you you will simply need to optimize the same way but I will remove the content for now and save